When I was working with AI tools like Cloud Code or Cursor in my Unity projects, especially if they are complex like this AR game, I found using LLMs really tedious as they don't have any context about your scene setup, game objects or project. But I also didn't want to give an LLM full control to manipulate my scenes using something like MCP. So during the development of my AR game Aviace, I built Magic AI Wingman, which is a simple Unity asset that doesn't require any new subscriptions or IDE and is also not designed to do any autonomous changes in your Unity scene. All it does is create detailed and structured reports of scenes, prefabs, project settings and so on, so that your LLM of choice can easily understand the context that you are talking about while not unnecessarily stressing the context windows. It was designed to be useful, especially in more complex Unity projects, to improve the development experience. A link to the asset is in the video description. I want to give you an idea how the Magic AI Wingman can help solving real issues. So we're here in my AR game. I also have my Rider IDE open and we start a new codex session. Recently I introduced a new game mode where two human players can play with two bots but for some reason the co-localization doesn't run as planned. The host simply starts the game despite the client is not ready yet. What I can do now in Codex is link the scene analysis generated by the Magic AI Wingman and then prompt the AI my question. I simply describe the issue, referring to the game flow, UI components and so on and ask Codex if they have any idea what might be the problem. And as we can see, it scans through the scene analysis of the linked scene using only the context which is necessary to solve this particular issue. With the scene analysis, it correctly finds which kind of logic is involved and scans these scripts. After a deep investigation, it does indeed find the issue, which is a more complex connection in between the core localization, networking and bot logic, which I could confirm to be the root cause. After confirming the issue on my end, I asked Codex to solve the problem and after a bit of thinking and changing something in the script, we can confirm that in the editor it is fixed and we have a flawless and synchronous co-localization flow. And in the same manner it is also working on the vice, which is pretty amazing. And all of that only works when the LLM has the correct context of the Unity project. Now let me show you how to use the Magic AI Wingman. After importing, you will find the asset under Window Magic AI Wingman. Opening the Magic Report Center, we can create reports of our own scenes, prefab and runtime debug logs, which can then be given to the LLM. As you can see, I already added some scenes. All we need to do for that is simply drag and drop a scene in here and click Analyze Cute Scenes to analyze all of them or click Gather Scene Analysis for the current scene. We also have a toggle here to auto run an analysis whenever you save a scene. Down here we have prefab groups where we can pretty much do the same. So add a new prefab by drag and drop. To analyze we can click on analyze group. We can also add new groups by clicking on add group and then drag and drop a new object in here. The runtime report can be started by clicking on start or auto toggle it with the next play captures all the debug logs without any select trace to not overflow context windows. To see what kind of reports we have, we can open the report folder and see scene prefab and runtime analysis, scriptable object analysis which is being done automatically, as well as project setting analysis which can be triggered under window magic AI wingman analyze project settings. We don't need to read these reports ourselves but can simply point to a file in our project by using the add and then enter analysis and either link a scene name or prefab name. We can also link the included LLM readme which gives the LLM instructions on how to search and use the reports properly. Alright, but that's it for this video. So let me know what you think about the Magic AI Wingman. Check it out in the description below and as always, thanks a lot for watching and see you next time.